What's up everyone, Crypto Informer here and I'm coming at you with another tutorial on how to day trade in CryptoCoin. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you guys how to sell at the top to protect your profit. One of the main issues I find with people is that they do not like to sell in a bull market. You should always wanna sell in a bull market because there will be pullbacks and those pullbacks is where you make even more profit if your goal is to hold in the long run. When we come into a market like BTC has been recently, we see that we hit a, a very strong resistance at 8,000. So what do you do? Well, what I suggest to do is you sell around the top in, pre in preparation for it to break through or pull back. So let us let me give you an example. Let's say you start off with 10 BTC. What I would suggest in the market that we have recently is we see a top right here and another pullback. And then we hit the top again. I would suggest selling at 79.60. If you had 10 BTC, you now have $79,600. I know a lot of you are screaming, well, you're going to miss the breakout. This is where we put a stop buy for 79,600. This stop buy means that when the price breaks through 8,000 and hits 8,000 and one penny, you will immediately buy at a market order for $79,600. This means you won't miss that wave and you'll ride it to huge profits as it goes up, which it most likely will because of the enormous amount of buying power that it's gonna to take to break through 8,000. The added benefit of doing this is that if there is a large pullback, which we see has happened, and we normally have one that's much larger than this. But let's just say we see this pullback that went down to 7521. Well, what you want to do is go ahead and take that profit that you have. You can cancel the stop buy anytime. So let's go ahead and cancel the stop buy and we'll take that 79600 and we'll go ahead and rebuy at 7521. Now we have 10 BTC and an extra 5.8. So what kind of profits do we get if we go back up? Well, my feeling is that if you're avoiding selling at the top, it's because you're afraid of missing out on something and you believe that it's gonna break through. Well, if you believe it's gonna break through, then when you rebuy and you have 10.58 now, you're in that much better of a position. So let's go ahead and see how much we could sell for now if we sell at the exact same price once it hits the top again. So we'll enter the 79.60. Now we're at 84. So we just made almost five grand by just simply saving our money, holding our money safely and buying back in after the market dipped. That's a fundamental lesson that I want to teach everyone because day trading is all about protecting your profit. And if you can take your profit at the top and prevent yourself a larger loss or prevent yourself a loss at all, why wouldn't you? Sure, you may miss out on a small amount of profit when it goes from seven, nine, sixty to 8,000, but look at how much we saved by rebuying at a better price. And then we ended up profiting as it rode back up an enormous amount. So why wouldn't you do that? And let's just imagine it had a pullback like it did two weeks ago, where it went all the way back down to 5,500. Imagine how much you could buy at that price. You'd be sitting pretty pretty. <laughs> so you would end up with 14.47 if you would have sold the top and it crashes all the way back down to 5,500, you rebuy, now you have 14.47. And let's just say once again, somehow magically it goes all the way back up. Well, you just made another nice amount of profit. So this is what I want to get through to everyone that please understand that selling at the top does not mean you're giving up. It means you're taking your profit and you're protecting your profit, just like a stop loss would do. Except for a stop loss puts you at the danger of the market bouncing down and coming back up immediately and you end up in a worse position. With this, you can't really end up in a worse position. This is protecting you completely. That's it for this tutorial. I hope you guys learned something. Uh, I'll be posting more tutorials as time goes on and I uh, will hopefully be starting to post daily crypto news that will notify you immediately on big market swings that I see, big news that I think is important, and when you should buy. That's all for me at Crypto Informer. Follow me, like, and I'll see you guys next time.